So uh, for anyone who didn't see it, we surveyed our clients in late September, and we asked a variety of questions about energy markets, expectations for oil prices, uh, on down the line. And um, one of the questions we asked that I think is pretty interesting is, when do you expect the first U.S. small modular reactor to reach commercial oper cop commercial operations? So uh, I think the results are pretty interesting. I'm going to just share what those are, and then maybe I want to ask each one of you uh, to give us a date, and that, that will be how we close out. So uh, the, the group of folks, some of you on this call probably participated. Uh, we had about 16%, say, by 2030. So that's pretty, pretty optimistic, pretty aggressive. We had 36 percent say between 2031 and 2033. We had 24 percent say between 2034 and 2036. Uh, we had 15 percent say after 2036, and we had nine percent say never. Uh, when, when are we going to see the first SMR operational in the U.S. commercial one? And give us the final takeaway you know what do you what do you want people to go uh you know and think about on this topic uh over the next uh days and weeks as they continue to kind of decide you know how, how to uh how to play this so you know saying that we think this is going to be happening i think in and of itself is a strong statement and even if you know our 60 percent uh ends up being uh, conservative or even aggressive, you know, there's a lot of money to be made if this actually happens, and I wouldn't discount that as well. And so, um, yeah, we're in kind of enthusiastic days, and you're at the early stages, and there's a lot of excitement. Uh, but as we go forward, assuming that there's no exogenous shocks and this story actually happens, uh, I think it's pretty exciting.